on in. Hi, darling. No. Valentina. 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 Now, if I remember correctly from your audition, you do a lot of sewing and things. Did you make that? I did not. But no. you do sew. I do sew. My type of drag doesn't speak to pop culture. It's more about elevating the art form through storytelling, through beauty, and through glamour. Fly, 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 uh oh, uh oh, fly, 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 uh oh, uh oh, fly, 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 uh oh, Lovely, lovely, lovely. Now, Valentina, you have a very distinctive aesthetic. Yes. Where did that come from? Watching telenovela. Really? Loving Miss Universe and old Hollywood glamour. I tend to do everything glamorous, but the Latina way. You remind me of some of the great Hollywood Latinas, like Dolores Del Rio. Yes, Dolores Del Rio, Lupe Vélez, yes. Maria Feli. Yes. Those you are my favorites. Oh, look, there's Trixie. She's, oh. got a, she's got a sign saying, free tux. Oh. We both know that there is no free tux. <laughs> Not in this world, honey. <laughs> <laughs> The audition process actually led for me to come out to my mom as a drag queen. Wow. I invited her to one of my shows, and she came on stage and gave me a red rose. Oh, how sweet. And I sang her, I, well, I lip-synced her favorite and my favorite song. What was your mother's reaction? Did she say, honey, I knew all along you were a drag queen? It all made sense to her because I've actually been going to performing art school my, my whole life, pretty much. Well, that was clue number one. Yes. <laughs> I'm really thirsty for attention, can you tell? Yeah. <laughs> Is your mother a, a glamazon herself? Is there a little bit of Valentina uh, in your mother? Yes, definitely. So does she wear makeup? She does wear makeup, full coverage. Full coverage, that's better than all state. <laughs> <laughs>